Samsung Galaxy Note 2 caught fire during an Indigo flight from Singapore to Shanghai yesterday morning. Although the phone was extinguished and disposed of safely, a spokesman for the Directorate General of Civil Aviation made a statement warning any users of Galaxy Note devices to, quote, exercise caution and either keep the devices switched off or not to travel with them at all. Samsung quickly acknowledged the incident, claiming that, quote, safety is their highest priority. Nvidia's GPUs could make a comeback in Apple's next-gen Mac lineup. As of now, AMD's GPUs have been present in the 15-inch Retina MacBook Pro, iMac lineup, and in the aging Mac Pro 2013. Last week, three job listings tied with Apple appeared in Nvidia's database. The rumored HTC Bolt may be missing something upon release. The smartphone will allegedly drop the good old headphone jack, like its competitors the Moto Z and the iPhone 7. An Intel, Lenovo, Synaptics, and PayPal partnership is making efforts to eliminate the need for multiple passwords with select services using FIDO fingerprint authentication. Future laptops from Lenovo will utilize synaptic biometric sensors, as well as Intel on-chip hardware security to replace passwords with FIDO-friendly services such as PayPal. The push for a more secure online future has begun, and the first generation of FIDO laptops are expected to come as early as CES 2017. Chris Ziegler, a deputy editor for The Verge, is said to have been employed to both Vox Media and Apple simultaneously. He is said to have gotten his position at Apple in July and soon after stopped communicating with Verge administration. When his secret was revealed, his employment at The Verge soon ended, according to a Vox Media spokesperson. A bit odd, don't you think?